Hello YouTube and welcome to lesson 3 of the InDesign tutorial series and today we're going to look at how to replace graphics inside of InDesign. So inside of InDesign you have something called wireframes right here. We'll be discussing about that in further lesson. I'm going to create two wireframes just like this. And now I'm going to import graphics or picture, picture file. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into file and I'm going to go into place just like this. So and in place, I'm going to go into my TutorTube folder right here. Now these are, the, are actually my thumbnails. So I'm going to go into TutorTube right here. And inside I got pictures and I got all the pictures right here. So you can see that I got a bunch of pictures. So I'm going to select three pictures by holding control or uh, yeah, three pictures just like that and open it up. So I got three pictures and if I were to click it over here, you can see that it actually gets replaced on that uh, file just like this. And if I had to click it here, you can see that everything has been cropped out. We're going to see this in further lessons, but if you want to solve that problem, what you can simply do is uh, after you open up a picture, you can just click and drag and you can see that the picture actually aligns well uh, to that uh, area just like that. Let me just uh, delete this one out and import that uh, one out again. So I'm going to go into a uh, file, go to place and then select three objects right here and then go to open. And then I'm going to click and drag, click and drag, and click and drag. And you can see that this is how you can drag in the objects inside of the uh, canvas. Just uh, click and drag. So that is how you can replace graphics and then import graphics inside of Adobe InDesign. Hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.